If you think Syria is nice, try getting outside in nature! Chris, what are you eating tonight? What are you eating? Wild ball sausages. Wild ball sausage? I have an I have an egg here. That's how you get a fire going by tuning your lighter. Look at this, look at this. <laughs> We've got the fishing rod here. Let's go. <laughs> we're making groceries here, ready to head out to the crazy cliff, guys. It's gonna be crazy. Oh, we're eating some lunch here before going into the, the cliffs. I woke up this morning, I was thinking, uh, I don't want to be the average camper. I want to, you know, do extraordinary things. So I got this suit here, and I made an amazing suit shop. I'll talk to you guys more about it later on. We've got some wild ball sausage here. Home, the homemade wild ball sausages. Homemade, homemade. Guys, uh, I'm taking a pissing break. There's a bit of headwind, unfortunately. But uh, it's alright, it's alright. Now we're going to visit uh, a, a church in the countryside, why not? We just stumbled across. When something something comes into our mind, uh, then we just do it. Actually, we have another outdoor city ginger. The, the, the city ginger 2.0. <laughs> city ginger 2.0. So now we step out of the car here, I'm gonna take my backpack uh, and I also have to uh, find a place where I can, you know, um, uh, because my, I have to, you know, take a, take a shit, right? So, okay, so I'm taking my backpack here, now we're going. I'm with the, the bro here, we are four guys yes, uh, yes. from Copenhagen. And, uh, well, the way I met him is because we have common friends and also we were in the nightclub... Uh, uh, Tuesday. Yeah, yes. uh, no, Thursday. Thursday, we yeah. were... <laughs> He lo you lost your phone there. Yeah, I lost my phone, unfortunately. unfortunately. One meter, 93 centimeters. And, looking uh, for girlfriend. Yeah, what? Looking for girlfriend. Yeah, looking for girls, yeah. Okay. So now we're going down to the, to the cliff. There are many tourists today, unfortunately. Uh, but you know, this is Denmark, this is not southern France. There's a beautiful sea behind here. Now we are at the uh, gorgeous cliff, 100 meters high. This is Kelt. Pure from nature, beautiful uh, cliff here. A lot of tourist people here. Okay, let's go down. We're gonna fish here tonight. All crazy stuff. Follow along, guys. Mother Nature, the herring. <laughs> Oh my goodness, guys, I just survived this water uh, everywhere. It was crazy. Just took the chloroform again. My my parents are soaking wet. It's crazy. But uh, I have to say, it's really beautiful beside the sea here. You did it great, man. Now we just on a camera. So how did you survive the. Yes, bro, a bit wet, but we survived. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My, my parents, bro. Can you film me fast? Bro, look at me, man. <laughs> look at me, bro. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I pissed on myself, right? So, to turn on a fine, miserable conditions, you can use your lighter. And if you tune it, you're gonna see there's gonna be a huge flame here. Look, big, you can see, it's a big, big flame. That's how you get a fire going, by tuning your lighter. Look at this, look at this. Buy some courage with this. Natural chalk, amazing. But the chalk you buy outside. It's cheap, it's not expensive, get out in nature. People today spend astronomic amount of money to get white shoes, here's what I do. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> and yeah, look at my shoes now. It looks like white, white like Air Force. Yeah, it went a bit white, luckily it's Gore-Tex. But uh, nature is rough, that's how you whiten your shoes. Get outside. The reason I am dressed up like this is not because I pretend to be cool and stuff like that. It's because uh, I had a discussion with my girlfriend at the home and she sent me away because we, I did not do good. And then, you know, I just had my work clothes on and now I'm alone in the, the wilderness and that's my story. I'm here with the bros. Chris, what are you eating tonight? What are you eating? Wild ball sausages. Wild ball sausage? I have, an, I have an egg here. Don't worry, I'm gonna eat it. Um, <laughs> yeah, we basically have food here. I'm dressed up uh, for a wedding soon <laughs> here. We got the fire. Life is great. <laughs> Life is great. Get outside in nature, guys. Egg in the face. 
That's how we start the day. This is how to make the perfect egg sandwich when you are in nature. Thank you, bro. Oh, a lot of walking. I'm going to get some cane. Give me the egg, come. I would not recommend wearing this fragrance out in nature simply because it's got a vanilla scent smelling of fruit and stuff. This would attract, this would attract bears, this would attract wolves, fox and coyotes. And they will associate it with food and this could inadvertently bring attention to the animals and they will think like, there's a prey we can go hunt. So fragrances keep them for the city, not here in nature. I've heard they're also inflammable I think, so they could also serve as a fire. But uh, yeah, I would not use them in the wilderness. Uh, because yeah, right here behind there could be bears, stuff like that, who wants to attack me, so you gotta be careful. Good challenge to come to Bale. Oh shit! There's fire in the can, why is there fire? That's because the oil is burning. When the oil is over 100 degrees Celsius, the fire is going on. If you think city is nice, try getting outside in nature! Get Make a fire the with the bros, with the sea. We just ate white ball sausages. We just made a fire. We are chilling here. It's getting, it's getting dark, and now yeah, we are, yeah, yeah, we are, will be going to camp somewhere else because uh, there's too much wind here. We're judging; it's not correct, but yeah, we'll bring you guys along. Good morning, guys. We just woke up here. I still have to shoot. I actually slept with it. Yesterday, I didn't get really to film the party it's the events because it was, it was too crazy. We left the cliff. And then we drive to, to a party place, to a wedding, and joined the wedding, and it was crazy. And now we sleep in, a, in the, we just woke up here, I don't know where. And now we're gonna say, uh, do some sailboats, it's gonna be great. So, uh, did you have a good, uh, good night yesterday, was it fun here? Yeah? Had a very good night, bro. Uh, very good night. And you were not freezing, did you freeze this night, or? No, bro, I could be out in, in t-shirt and everything. You okay. Know, sleep very well, sleep very well. Oh, nice. Yes, yes, it was very nice. Yeah. And Tungbana. Now we are going sail boating, it's gonna be really nice. Follow along. Exactly. It's going to be amazing. It's actually your boat. Yeah. Thank you, man. You're welcome. We're eating an amazing breakfast here with the boys. With Everything the boys. is uh, served, and uh, it's uh, amazing to eat uh, food with you guys. Uh, it's so funny to meet you. In, uh, pleasure. Yeah, it's a blessing. Definitely, yeah. So, what are you eating? I'm eating uh, scrambled eggs. Eric, Eric the Red was a Viking who was expert in traveling and sailing through Europe. He had the adventurous spirit, resilience and determination. And that's what we get. We are actually Vikings went Denmark here. So in the boat you can do lives here. You can also do leg races. And that's what you need. You need the adventurous spirit when you're out here. I'll show you the boys I'm with here. We all have the resilience and determination to actually go traveling. There's only one way and it's forward. Get outside. Get inspired by the Vietnam Vikings and Eric the Red, my uh, uncle. Like, Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, I just leave the boat here. You can like and subscribe. See you next time. I hope you liked it. The adventure was a bit chaotic. Each weekend we are killing it. See you next time.